You like her outfit? Oh. Oh, such a gentleman. Hi, Chip. Oh. Oh, 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 what Whoa. is this? That's ski. Whoa. There's no nuts in here. Oh. You oh, like my shirt? It's oh, it's spooky. It is a spooky shirt. It's spooky. A little bit yes. spooky. I'm a little early for Halloween. It's okay. Never too early. Never too early. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, twirl. A little twirl. Yes. Nice twirl. Wonderful. Walked right in and Chip Dale hanging out in the uh, lobby here. We are on our way to Artist Point, so I'll see you there. At this point, the appetizers came out and it started off with the kiddos fruit and vegetable plate. We got a wild mushroom bisque with chive oil, a hunter's pie, which is like a meatball with like a phyllo dough underneath it, and a wicked shrimp cocktail, which was interesting. So kiddo, how is your appetizers, the kids appetizer? Yeah, the bread is good. What about the dirt? They said they had dirt. Yeah. yeah, it's good. You gonna try the meatball? So what's in it? It's a meatball with a dough. Yeah, I'm gonna give that a try. Mommy said it's not a finger food, but I think it is. Uh oh, we have something going on. Before we were interrupted by dwarves, I was trying to. If you have an autograph for me, I have an open and ready for fun. Okay, okay great. Phone's ready to take pictures, and I know you're ready. I'm ready to go. I was trying to tell you the meatball is very good. Nice little spicy meat, very good. With everything going on, I forgot to do the review of the soup. It is an excellent soup with a creamy texture, and the chive oil adds a nice touch to it. It was actually our favorite appetizer. Everyone raved about it. Last appetizer we have is a shrimp cocktail. Ooh, that's like a shrimp cocktail Diablo. A little spicy, almost like a tomato. Almost like a like a Bloody Mary as a shrimp cocktail. It's good. FYI, you can ask for more of something. So if you want more shrimp cocktail, you can get more shrimp cocktail, which we asked for.
Well, hello. How do you do? It's so lovely to see you all today. Yes, won't you join me and I can sign for you too. I'll get the open for you, Snow White. I love your red dress. It matches my red bow. You must have done that on purpose. It is my very favorite color after all. As red as the rose in bed. <laughs> Did your chipmunks help with the sewing a little? I thought so. My chipmunks Always help me with the sewing after all. Your tiny hands are perfect for details, don't you think? Now there was prime rib on the menu and normally I'm a prime rib every time guy, but I just made a smoked prime rib last night, so I went pork shank, which was supposed to be the best item on the menu. First comment, no knife needed. You can just pull it off with your fork. Tender, it's got a great sauce on it. The polenta is great. I do recommend this dish. Very good. How is the grilled chicken and mac and cheese? So good. Yeah? Big fan? Yeah. Was it cool to meet Snow White? Yes. Are you excited to meet the dwarves? No. All right, they should be coming soon. Don't be. Dopey's coming? Okay. Hi, Dopey. Aww. Are you enjoying this video? If so, there are a few things that you can do that would really help Dad out. Go ahead and subscribe. Give the video a like and hit the notification bell. That would be great. Tell you what to do. Bottom branch is Grumpy's favorite, and Snow White's name is Gooseberry Pie. 
you've never had a gooseberry, think of like a tart green apple. It makes sense why Grumpy of all people would like it. On top, we've got a marshmallow meringue and some matcha powder to balance out that plate. Second one right there, that's our miner's treasure. It's a cookies and cream panna cotta with a white chocolate miner's hat, some chocolate gems, and because we whistle while we work around here, some purple whipped cream. Last but not least, we go with the Queen's Poison Apple. It's a dark chocolate mousse with a decadent sour cheddar. I'll switch those to die for and then I'll get out of here before you know what I even need. Enjoy, folks. Thank you. Can you do two? I know that's, I know. I know. They barely see you, so. You might be doing one here and one here. She did a dot. And one more because you're a star. Oh, okay. I hold it hard. That's it. I won't ask for any more. Yep. All right. If you remember in the story of Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, the Queen demanded Snow White's heart in a box just like this from the Huntsman. However, here in the Enchanted Forest, all that we can offer you is our chocolate hearts instead. Oh, wow. Yes. Okay. Dessert time. Mmm. Like an apple pie. That's good. Some kind of apple. Ooh. It's like a mousse. That was unexpected. Mmm. Daddy, this is mousse bed. Remember? It's really good. Very good. Different. That's what I'm trying next, the Oreo pudding. Mm. It's got a great texture to it. How are the desserts, kiddo? Oh, well. And to finish it off, I'm going to try the... Uh, the Queen's heart, or Snow White's heart. It's a little morbid, but yeah. Yeah, it's like the Queen's heart. Snow White's heart. Mmm, good chocolate. And that does it from Artist Point. I hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. Dad may be quite intimidated by the evil queen, but that doesn't do outros, so that's it. Bye. If you enjoyed that video, why not throw dad a good old like and subscribe and do the notification thing or leave me a comment about what your favorite part of this video was. That would really help dad out and you can go check out one of these other videos. I'm sure they're fantastic. I mean, I, I made them so I'm pretty sure they're fantastic. All right, yeah, do that stuff.